This does not look like a jungle. These plants I'm living for. And these prices are pretty decent. This plant right here is only $34.99. Then they have all these beautiful flowers that already come in a vase. This one is only $19.99. Let me know if you're seeing anything that's catching your eye. Are you decorating your house this year for spring? Are you one of those people? Because I'm trying to be one of those people who decorates for the seasons and the holidays. Because as y'all know, I'm in my wife prep right now. So I'm trying to activate my homemaker gene. So let me know what you did to get your homemaker gene going. Y'all check out how adorable this is. This is only $7.99, which I feel like is really reasonable. And this is what they got for us for easter they actually got a lot for us a lot of bunnies to pick from y'all check out these funky bunnies these are adorable how much are these these are only 5.99 these are cute but i would like a classic just a white bunny this one's only 5.99 these are super cute oh look at these bunnies back here kissing only 5.99 then we have some more grandiose ones but still in like a neutral shade, you know, yes, they are gold, but gold blends with other colors. Then they have some Easter tumblers. This one's actually really classy. This is Peter Rabbit themed and it's $12.99. Look at this Peter Rabbit tea kettle. I actually high key need a tea kettle, but I want the one that like heats up on its own so I can be, you know, a high tech girly. Got some more decorations back here. For whatever reason, mushrooms are in. I don't know what's going on in the world. I'm seeing mushrooms everywhere, but these are kind of funky cool. And y'all, this thing is heavy. Oh my gosh. But why is it only $16.99? I can get down with that price. And this mushroom here right here is a lamp and it's only $29.99. This one's gorgeous. Oh yes, y'all. Is this not giving bikini bottom? Do you not feel like SpongeBob? Whenever I see mushrooms, I think of bikini bottom, Squidward, Sandy. This is cute. I'm not sure the brand of this, but these are gorgeous. They have three shades. They have this darker green and a lighter green, and then this peach. Here are some funky cool planners. If you've been checking out my Five Below Shop With Me's, you know that they have also been doing some cool planners. Oh, oh, this is only $7.99. I can get with that price. Check out these vases. This one's only $9.99. I'm feeling like these kind of shapes are really in right now. And then of course, you know, they got the faux plants that are already potted. Let's see what's popping over here in these candles. If y'all know anything about me, you know the kid loves her a candle. And what I also love about TG Maxx is they love to be color coordinated, especially with the seasons. So look at this end cap that they have for us for Easter spring season. How stinking cute is this honey pot? Oh Lord, and it's only $5.99. Let's smell this, y'all. This is delectable. This is a mango milk pudding. Oh, it is fabulous. Check out this beautiful candle. This is giving Alice in Wonderland. It's only $9.99. The smell is very potent. It's not horrible, but it's not amazing either. But just looking, I wouldn't even burn this thing. I would just have it in there as decor. And then here goes some cream soda candles. And again, if you have checked out any of my recent Bible Shop With Me's, you know that they have been carrying a cream soda candle line for only $5.55. Not sure of the brand, but y'all, these smell lovely. They have three scents for only $6.99. We have a melon fizz, lemon splash, and then an orange cream. And they all smell delectable and delicious. But this lemon splash is doing something to me and i'm loving this yellow but all these candles y'all that's what tj maxx they be trying to take all my money because they be having the most fabulous candles and the packaging and who can say no to a seven dollar candle now this one they're tripping 1299 what the f this is a lemon lime so this is like a giant version of these little babies let's smell this one why does this smell just like lemon lime i can't let's see what's popping in the shoes i'm seeing some real cute shoes if you guys didn't know i am a size nine yes i know it's odd considering i'm only five foot three but these are catching my eye these are really cute are these just Simpson? y'all i think these might be used in return because i can't even see the designer and then look at the, the bottom. So it seems like this style of shoe was back in. Do you guys remember? Oh shoot, what year was that? I was still in college. That is really when Jessica Simpson's shoes were popping. Era was doing the, the chunky platform. So you had the chunky heel and the real thick platform. I really like that style. So I'm not too mad that it's coming back in. 
And then they have these cute little Mary Janes from Steve Madden. And they also have them in red. What's the price on these? $39.99. I'm not too, too mad at that, but I'm also not happy either. See, they have these little kitten heels. I want to swing back. And these are on sale for $24. Let's find the clearance section so we can see what's going on back there. They have these cute little flats. Oh, I like these little Birkenstock wannabes. How much are these? It's really $24.99. I'm feeling that price. So it definitely seems like all the styles and things that I was wearing in the early 2000s is definitely back in action. All right, here's the clearance. Let's see what's going on over here. Not too much, mainly sneakers. But these are actually kind of cute. These are $26. These are, I think, Reebok. Yeah, these are Reebok. Are these, oh, these are Donna Karen for 32. It's kind of high for Donna Karen. Oh, y'all, look at these. These are adorable. Now, I have been high key wanting some loafers since they have come back in style, but I have not found any that look cute on me. We're going to try these on because these are almost my size. They're a nine and a half, but I think I can get away with it. Unfortunately, y'all, these were way too loose. Uh, but they're so cute nonetheless. And they're only $32. Let's see what their featured shoes are. They have these here from Jessica Simpson. These from Dolce Vida. This is what the Jessica Simpson look like. But y'all, I'm actually not mad at this style. These, I think, would be perfect for, like, vacation. Even the summertime when you're picking up your kids from school. These would look great. Let's see what they have going on in the other shoe sizes. But sometimes in my shoe size, it'd be kind of limited. So it's looking like they mainly just have sneakers and pumps. They haven't put out too many summer and spring shoes in these sizes. It's not too big of a disparity when it comes to size. Cause you know, sometimes the smaller feet people, they get more choices than us bigger feet people do. I really like these y'all. I actually had an aunt who used to wear shoes like these and she was so fabulous. These are by Rachel Zoe. I happen to really like her. I used to watch her reality show. These are only $29.99. And high key y'all, I think I could fit these. All these, although these are seven and a half, I think I can get my foot in here. All right, I tried them on. My foot does fit, but of course, I have some heel hanging off the end, but I think I can get away with it. With some wide leg pants, I could definitely get away with this and no one will know that my foot's too big. Look at these cute little Skechers shoes. These are, why are these $50? Y'all, when did Skechers get so expensive? These are really cute from Reebok. These are 40, which I'm not quite sure why. I, I have several pairs of Reeboks and I haven't paid more than $20 for them. So I don't know why these are 40. These are real cute. These are also 40, what the F? Do y'all have a certain brand of sneaker that y'all like to wear? I wear everything, as long as it's comfortable, I'll wear it. The only thing that sneaker that I won't do are like fashion sneakers. So I do prefer to get name brands. So like, I really like Reebok. Like these are cute, these really cute chunky platform pumas oh these are only forty dollars let's check out a new aisle let's see what they got over in this wellness aisle i don't think we've ever checked it out over here before what's catching my eye are these vitamins if you guys have been on tiktok i know you've been seeing people pushing vitamins a lot lately at least i have been seeing people push vitamins a lot lately years ago this was really popular this currently right now at kroger it's like forty dollars for this size bottle and right now it's only 11.99 and these got real popular because people were saying that these were really good appetite suppressants so if you were trying to lose weight they're recommending that you take these this might be our opportunity to try some because i can get down with 11.99 and then they have these from the brand nature's truth this is their turmeric and cumin and ginger gummies so to me that sounds like it would be good for digestion because ginger is great for digestion as well as turmeric and cumin then they have these little sleep ones it has melatonin and it. it has 12 milligrams of melatonin which actually is not too bad because most pills of melatonin are only three milligrams so you're getting essentially four pills in one little gummy i wonder if these work how much are these these are only 8.99 and then they have some of the Ollie brand up in here. Now, personally, I've heard reviews on this brand, but it's been like mixed reviews. So like some people say that they're good and some people say not so much. And if you watch any of my vlogs, you know that I am big 
on vitamins but right now i'm out of my vitamins i was taking a prenatal vitamin that i was purchasing from walmart by the brand spring valley and they just weren't doing it well i thought like they weren't doing anything for me like my nails weren't growing my nails were weak because you know in prenatal vitamins it has biotin all that good stuff in it and i just felt like i wasn't getting anything out of it so if you know of any good prenatal vitamins specifically for women over the age of 35 that are looking to conceive let me know in the comments because i'm definitely interested i'm definitely needing a new prenatal or if you know like a combination of vitamins to try it doesn't necessarily have to be prenatal but I do want to be taking something that is going to be targeted towards my uterine health and this is something interesting I am very much into probiotics the probiotic that I take y'all is $42 yes it's high as hell I need a lot of digestive support I have to take digestive enzymes with every meal if not i'm super bloated so if you two are experiencing a lot of bloating after you eat no matter what it is that you eat your body is probably not properly breaking down your food so you might want to try some digestive enzymes the ones i try are from the brand solar ray and these are only 6.99 so let's check out these ingredients we might try these because they don't raise the price on my digestive enzymes from 12.99 to 6 15.99 and i'm not happy about that all right, here's something cool I haven't seen before from the brand Onyx Professional. As y'all know, we are in our DIY self-care bag. I've been doing my own manis and petties, and I definitely need something for my heels. I'm about to order me one of those little metal scrapers that they use at the nail salons for my heels. And I also want to try, like, another cool, like, little heel peeling product. And I also got a... um foot mask not this one you know i got my dollar tree but i got a mask to try so let's see we can get them as a double pair or we can get them as single so let's see this is the crack heel stick we get results in seconds we roll on and go so it seems like it's just a moisturizer so it's not going to peel our heel which is what i was hoping for i need something that's going to peel my heel off so these are petty sponges so these look like they're already infused with things and we just scrub our feet with them so this one has shea butter and tea tree oil it says we can get 20 washes out of it it's only 3.99 i'm not mad at that they have this one that is pina colada this one that's watermelon and this one is say sweet sangria Ooh, that sounds fine let's see what's going on in skincare quite packed over here I'm seeing a lot. Oh, we have something here from Glossier. They're treating this box nice. So this is $12.99. This, this is their concentrated cleanser. It is a clarifying face wash. And I think I told you guys in my most recent shop with me, I forget where I was shopping at, but I was telling you guys, oh yeah, I was at Dollar Tree and um, Global Beauty Care's new acne line in the green packaging, they have a clarifying cleanser. And y'all, I've tried it. As you guys know, I am a makeup girly, so I double cleanse my face. And that clarifying cleanser really helped my face feel a lot cleaner. So if you see that product, definitely try it. But this one just looks fancier. And it's only $12.99. Because even if you don't wear a lot of makeup, if the product itself doesn't you know, have good ingredients in it, you're gonna be struggling to get your makeup off. Here is something with some snail mucus in it in a glass bottle for only $6.99. This is Farmstay Snail Mucus Moisture Toner. This is beautiful. Let's see what we can find new in makeup. Yeah, last time we were here, it was popping. It was so organized. Today, it's not too bad. Not as popping as it was last time we were here, but they have some stuff from the cream shop. Seeing that they have some movie collections. This one is Cinderella Midnight Rush. This is gorgeous in this packaging. Absolutely stunning. And they also have Lilo and Stitch as well as Winnie the Pooh. Another Another Disney princess, Ariel. Y'all, I used to love me some Ariel growing up. I used to have a plate set. I had a plate, a bowl, a cup. I had utensils. Y'all, I wore that stuff out so bad that my plate was cracked that my mom had to make me throw it away. That was such a sad day. This Ariel palette is not terrible, but it's not giving Ariel or under the sea. What do you think? Very heavy with the blues and the greens. It's definitely giving stitch. Oh, this Winnie the Pooh is so cute. 
The color story definitely matches, matches the packaging. I see if they're leaning towards a more muted pastel. All right, let's check out the bags and the luggage. I've already told y'all our first trip is next month and the kid does need some new luggage. I really like this color, it's speaking to me. How much is this? Y'all, why is that thing $89.99? They got me messed up, but it's a three piece set and it also comes with this cute little thing. Oh, this is a little laundry thing. Oh, and this is only $24.99. I'm not mad at that, but I am mad at $89.99. Like, what the hell? I actually, some years ago, bought me a Diane Von Furstenberg three-piece luggage set from TJ Maxx for $129 for all three pieces. So the fact that they want $89.99 for one piece, they got me messed up. How much are you guys willing to spend on luggage? Like, do you have a limit? Is there a line that you draw on the sand when it comes to how, how much you're willing to pay to be cute in the airport? Because I do. Like, y'all know I'm all about the looks over here. But there is a line. I really would like some new luggage, but you know, I want to deal on it. This one's real cute from DKY. I really like this like dark mauve shade and it is on sale for $56.99. I don't have a carry-on size bag because I usually carry a duffel bag that I actually got from here from Betsy Johnson. Betsy Johnson be having some bomb stuff, y'all. All right, so let's see what we can find new in handbags. We're starting over here in the blacks. This is adorable. This is from Kate Spade. This is very classy. This is $129. I have another Kate Spade back here. This cutie is $129. This is just classy and it's never gonna go out of style. And I'm getting really into these puffer bags. I'm pretty sure we saw this last time we shopped here at TJ Maxx. And for whatever reason, this is $49.99. I understand and it's Vince Camuto, but Vince is tripping. We're not giving him $50 for that. And they have some totes and backpacks. Check out this beautiful bag from Steve Madden. It's only $39.99. I'm not mad at that. And then uh, we've already talked about denim being back ends. We should see a good amount of denim. So here is that Kate Spade bag in a light taupe shade. Very cute. Y'all, they done brought that belt bags. If y'all didn't know, I'm an 80s baby, 90s kid. So during the 90s, I was like in my teen years. And this print was in, belt bags were in. So it looks like you can uh, wear this two ways. Or no, is this a belt bag? Yes. So y'all, we can do this our, as a belt bag or we can do it separately. So we can carry it by its little top handle or we can belt it to the belt and belt it to ourselves and make it a belt bag. I'm not mad at that. And I high key really like this print. If I'm not mistaken, my boutique sells a dress called Donatella that is like very close to this print. Some cute totes from DKNY, some Michael Kors. This location used to carry a lot of Michael Kors, but I've been noticing, I have not been seeing as much Michael Kors in here lately. This is really nice from Nine West. Only 30, this is only $34.99. And this beautiful bag from Donna, from DKNY for $39.99. Something cute from Anne Klein from $34.99. This is real cute. And I like this little detail. Oh, this is lovely. This is from the brand Boat Keer. I think that's how you say it. And it's only $49.99. But this leather material is looking real leather. Oh, y'all, look at this freaking cute bag from Steve Madden. They got some real gorgeous stuff going on over here. They are still stocking several bags that are Bottega Veneta dupes. And in previous videos, I have showed you guys what those Bottega Veneta bags go for and also what they look like in comparison to the bags that we are seeing here in TJ Maxx. They look almost identical. But check out this cutie right here for only $34.99. If this doesn't scream, I need to be out for spring. I don't know what does. And here is that Anne Klein bag that we have seen multiple times. Seems like they have finally marked her down. She's only $24. She may have to be ours. 
this is your first time here and you didn't know, I am a white bag lover. Oh yeah, forgot to show you guys my new color on my nails. Don't look at them too closely. Um, this is a nail polish that I got from Dollar Tree from the Color Vibes. You guys remember that blue shade that I had on? This is um, the same brand, but in white. And for whatever reason, the white is doing me wrong, y'all. The blue is loving me, but this white, it wants to chip. It chipped like not even 24 hours of me wearing it, but I digress. Um, look at this cutie. This definitely is Bottega Veneta dupe. And she's only $29.99. Yeah, they have a lot of great options for us guys for spring bags. So if you're trying to stop carrying black bags this spring, definitely come to TJ Maxx because they have a lot of bright colored bags and several different sizes. What is this little cutie here? This is actually really cute. It comes, this has come in it. Oh, this is like a two for one for only $40. So we get two bags for the price. So this is basically $20 each, essentially. Actually, if we include this little coin purse, that's more like $17.99 each. 